Hi, Chris Wallace from Second Swing. We're in Orlando, Florida today. It's the 2018 PJ Merchandise Show with Callaway. I'm with Dave Neville. Dave, good to see you. Good to see you, Chris. We're going to talk right now about MD4 Wedges, Mac Daddy 4. This has obviously been a great franchise for you guys. We've talked previously about the technology. What we want to talk right now about are the sole grinds because it's a huge deal for players to pick wedges that will fit both their swing and the conditions where they play. So we're going to have you, if you would, four different sole grinds in this, including a brand new one. We're going to have you walk us through each one, tell us a little bit about how they're different, and then who each one's going to work for. It's one of those things that mystifies a lot, a lot of players. Which grind should I be in? And people think it's very, very complicated. We tried to simplify it with this line. We have four grinds. They're pretty easy to understand, so we'll walk through each in order, starting with the C grind. So that's our crescent sole. The C stands for crescent sole. It's our lowest bounce option. It's really for that shot maker, the guy who likes to open it up around the green. Has really good technique. It's the lowest bounce option of the four. Probably the least forgiving of the of the four as well. That That's the C grind. Then we have the S grind, that's our standard sole, that's what the S stands for, it's just for most players, you know, it's 60-70% um, of the market, it's got a little chamfer on the back, but it's really for the player who likes to hit that square face shot, it's going to be very forgiving, it's a mid-bounce type, we have that all across, all the way from our pitching wedge, all the way up to our, our lob wedge as well. The third grind is our W grind, our wide sole, it's the most forgiving option that we have, it's the widest sole, highest bounce, it can be for somebody who needs a little help out of the bunker, you know, we have in the 54 and the 56, we have in the 58 and 60 um, as well. You can still hit a lot of shots around the green for uh, with it, but it's going to be the most forgiving. Widest sole with a little bit of radius or, or camber to it. And then our final grind is the X grind. And that's the new grind, the one Roger's very excited about. The X stands for extreme C. So it's a high bounce version of the C. It's a crescent sole as well, high bounce, really for that better player. So it's really for the better player who tends to get steep. So a lot of tour players were asking for this from Rogers, so that's why we put it in the line. So we have the C, the S, the W, and the new X. One thing we did with this line to try to simplify it is we're consistent with the bounce number for each grind. So all the C's are eight degrees, all the S's are 10, all the W's are 12, and all the X's are 12 as well. So it's very easy for, the, for a player to understand. And would you concur that typically for players who play in softer terms, softer sand as opposed to firmer turf, a little more bounce will help them. In yeah, bounce is your is your your friend there. So two things you want to look at. You want to look at your swing type and the, the type of courses that you play. Depends on if you, you travel or not. But in terms of swing type, if you tend to be a slider or sweeper, tend to be very shallow into the ball, you can tend to get away with, with less bounce. So you can play the C grind or the S, S grind. If you tend to get very steep, you know, big divots, you want to look at the W or the X. And then you want to look at the course conditions as well. You know, if you're up in Minnesota, if it's soft conditions, a little bit more balanced, so the W or the X is going to help you. If you're in very, very firm, like Colorado type of conditions, or British Open type of conditions, you can get away with a, a C grind, or maybe maybe with the S grind. So you got to look at both. you got to look at your technique, but also the course conditions you play. Based on what you heard from Dave, if you feel like you've got the wrong wedges for your game, we'll take your old wedges off your hand, get you in some new MD4s, have you playing better golf, hitting better shots around the green this year. Dave, great information. We appreciate it. Thank you.